Hi everybody, happy Friday. Setting up dinner here, I'm on the tail end of it. Uh, I had multiple things going on at the same time, so I had to pay attention to it. I didn't want it to overcook, so that's the reason why I'm jumping on now. I made uh, cauliflower rice, Mediterranean cauliflower rice, and I'm making chicken uh, with bacon and avocado. I did a much healthier version. I'm using avocado oil. I also made the homemade guacamole using uh, Pampers Chef's guacamole mix and our uh, avocado tool. I made it, uh, ground up some bacon, did some turkey bacon, so it's a little bit healthier. And then, of course, the cauliflower rice uh, in place of regular rice. Uh, it also has almonds in it and a whole bunch of seasonings. That's really all it is. Super, super simple. The chicken is browning right now. It's almost done. Once that's done, turn off the gas. Gonna put some guacamole on each one. Cover it with some goat cheese and bacon. Let that sit and melt. And we'll have a really nice dinner there. And like I said, the avocado, mm, the uh, cauliflower rice is already done. I'm just keeping it warm on here. I don't want it to overcook. A little bit on the spicy side. I will post the actual um, the recipe is when I'm done, and uh, I will let you know how everything is. It should be delicious, it looks delicious, that's why we're actually doing it. Uh, if you guys have any questions, actually, you know what, this is almost done. So let me check in with our temperature thermometer. These are good. These are also spiced as well. What do I have on here? I've got avocado oil, cumin, paprika, and garlic salt on the chicken already. Then the guacamole is going to go on top of that. And then the uh, cheese and the bacon. And the bacon and the cheese. So, these are almost going to turn off the gas. That's a nice block here. Put helping on each one. You don't have to, you should be fine. Is this your own original recipe? Yeah, it's right over there. I printed it off. I wish you would put nuts in the cauliflower rice. You are nuts. So it's the last step. I wasn't talking to you, Boop. All right, just gonna go under the broiler for a couple of minutes to get everything all nice and melted, and I'll post pictures of the end results. If you got any questions, you know where I'm at. Thanks, guys.